A leather strop will allow you to maintain the edge on your blades. In this tutorial, I'll teach you how to make a leather strop. Without further ado, let's begin this tutorial. To make a leather strop, you'll need smooth vegetable tan leather with no textures on the grain. In terms of the thickness of the leather, as long as the leather is firm and dense like vegetable tan leather, it will be fine to make a strop. I'll be using 1.2 to 1.5 thick natural vegetable tan leather. You can glue two pieces together to make it thicker if you like. Some wood, any length is fine as you can cut it to length. In terms of width, just make sure it's not too narrow. Some polished compound, some sandpaper, 200 to 300 grit. The first step is cutting the wood to length. I'll be cutting this piece to 315 millimeters. If you want to carve a handle for the strop, you're more than welcome to. The next step is to cut out the leather, then apply adhesive to the flesh side of leather and the wood. I'll be using water-based contact adhesive. Press both pieces together. Next is to sand the grain surface of the leather to make the leather more even and consistent. I would recommend using a respirator at this stage and doing it outdoors as opposed to doing it indoors. If you do do it indoors, just make sure to use a vacuum cleaner to clean up any of the leather dust. Next is to apply some polish compound and that's it. Here are some tips that you can use when you're using this strop. Don't forget to sign up to our email list. Receive your exclusive access to the Leathercraft newsletter, editions one and two now available. And you'll also be kept up to date with the latest courses, videos, and more. And also don't forget to like and subscribe and be sure to enjoy your leather crafting.